Oh, no. Come on, come on, get through that fucking battle portal. Who else can I fuck up with this damn thing? Let's use this thing. Hell yeah. Fuck him up, imp. The conflict resolved. Shakespeare Thank you. eagerly awaited meeting the champion that dispatched so many of his men. Undoubtedly, they were here for the Bard's aid. And while happy endings were not a thing found in hell, Shakespeare always had a soft spot for comedies. Lit. In the land of the living, William Shakespeare is regarded as one of the most prolific playwrights of all time. However, to the denizens of hell, the bard is seen in a far different light. After selling his soul for fame and adoration, Shakespeare served in hell as Satan's spy master general. In doing his duty, Shakespeare would punish the souls he was investigating by forcing them to perform in grotesque passion plays for Satan's amusement. But in a Twelfth Night-esque twist, Shakespeare found himself living a double life. While he projected an image of cruelty, his heart was as soft as Jezebel's. In secret, he would tutor her on the classics and act out the works of his mortal days. When Satan found out, he cast Shakespeare out of the palace, believing that the poet would be tormented by the populace of hell, far out of Jezebel's sight. But Satan had not counted on the bard's cunning. Embracing his persona of master torturer, Shakespeare and his followers, the tragedies, took root in the entertainment district, biding their time for revenge. Lit. Sorry, lit hair. So Shakespeare called <laughs> forth the deus ex machina to bestow our protagonist with the arcane power of force stomp. Lights up. The mortal stands in the training grounds, eager to try out his new force stomp power on the group of demons in front of them. One, scene two. In which our protagonist is two. In which our protagonist is greeted by foul imps. Where? Our protagonist learns that Force Stomp even works on flying enemies, enabling them to remove a Dark Insider's shield before shooting them to death with bullets. There is also a mistaken identity and love unrequited. Okay. Oh no. Oh shit. Can't fall off the training grounds. Did I do it? My children are endless. The day is won, and the curtain closes on our noble oh, hero. Oh, fucking fell off that damn fucking... Oh shit! Oh wait, I was like, who the fuck is shooting at me? Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, so where the frick? Rally Vlad, okay, let's do this. He's all the fucking way over here. Oh yeah, I forget, he's on his own island. He's the one that's in the fucking, like, crazy ward.
Right. <laughs> Got it. This area is gonna be fun to explore. Oh shit! Oh um, hell! Land softly. Air. You just do that. That just makes the landing faster. How do I switch between the powers? Let's see. Uh, F2? Ah, so they're the F keys. Now I understand. I was like, okay, well, how do you switch? Because I like the imps a little bit more. They're fun. Especially when you get to, like, upgrade them and they get better and better. Let's go! Yeah, beach. Right on. Oh no, I almost missed that one. Like, what the fuck? Okay, there we go. Wonderful. Sorry, I'm just a little distracted. Like, people are texting and calling me. I'm like, ah, uh, can you wait? <laughs> It's like the roommate, Mary Kay, and all that shit. Oh gosh. This is what it feels like in the therapist's office. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Maybe I should just turn on music for just a little bit. Just, just, just to humor ourselves. Because why not, right? Can we do a 25? Yeah, there you go. Who's death now? I just killed someone. Fuck <laughs> him up. That's how you aim, you frickin' right click. <laughs> Didn't I kill you already? It comes back to life. Does the banality of this children's song not drive you mad? This isn't pop music. You are a strange woman. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna switch to stomp. And if I can get to them and I can stomp. Out of the way. Where are they at? <laughs> there's, there's that guy. Oh shit. Oh. I think I'm supposed to kill this guy too. Burn the hornless one. Yas, batch. Look at get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. <laughs> we must end uh, this take it off. Infernal music. Come. Let us return to my castle. So we may plot our next steps in proper surroundings. Lit. We're good. Johnny led Vlad back to his castle, which since his incarceration became a haven for frat parties and squatters. But the systematic impaling of trespassers would have to wait. Vlad was a man of his word, and was eager to provide intel that could aid in hobbling Satan's armies. Nice. I bestow upon you the Stygian cold fire. Oh. 
and that one's F4. I brought you to this inferno to teach you about the power I have granted you. Let's do it. Cold fire is an aura, which means you must activate the power and get close to an enemy. Hello. Or they will feel the cold embrace of the Stygian flames. Try it against these demons. I like ran out that last second. Yeah. Now here comes a dark inciter. Use your aura, then get close to you've done it. Doesn't it feel good to watch an enemy burn? Let. That was easy. Alright, let's see. Let's switch back. <sighs> Looking forward to stretching my wings. Yeah. I think they're just in downtown, so they're over here. Oh, hell. Fucking ambulance. Let's just get out of the way of the ambulances. Hold on. Actually, do I need to collect anything in the meantime? Let's check my tab. Let's see. Uh, arcane. Just these. Easy. I already have all of that. Cool. Alright. Yeah. Ooh, we can get one of those. Ah, oh, did that just fuck up my flying? It did. Hold on. That usually helps to go down. All right, they're just over here in the hard downtown. Barnstorming? Where did I do barnstorming? Oh shit, it's over here on the side. Here you go. Oh shit. <laughs> I landed weird. Okay. They're up here. Hello. Wait, I thought only one of them died, so how are they both here? We're standing in a parking garage. I don't like it either, but Cinderpool isn't giving us many options. I can't believe they tried to force us out. I can't believe you forgot the mimosas. I think we have bigger problems. I don't think you realize how much I love mimosas. Oh, great. Hold on, I've let me get up. The people are trying to kill you. Yeah, they're really big on that here. What did you do? Is now really a good time? We can wait until we're done shooting people. Well, I'm great at multicasting. Remember when we offered you a deal on that airplane and you responded by killing everyone? Yeah. It's like that, but worse. Get out of here, you fucking. You really didn't have a chance. I know you're back there. Bitch. <laughs> you can't fucking hide. Get out of here. Alright. Who else is out here? Oh, shit. <laughs> See if I can affect him. Yeah, 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 I did. That's how you do it easy. Hey, Viola. Ah, oh, shit. I thought you should know that Kinsey misses you. Really? That's so sweet. Who's Kinsey? You remember Kinsey. She was that hacker that Matt Miller hated. Isn't she crazy? You know, she really grows on you. <laughs> um, I guess. Oh, no, there's more backup. Okay. Oh, they can't even fucking drive. Stop flying in circles, goddammit. Ah! 
<laughs> I can't. Ah, oh, damn it. Where's the other ones? 